Joining us now is Ron Calhoun, Senior Manager for Plant Nutrition at Loveland Products. Ron, talk about the challenges that cool, dry weather can bring when trying to add nutrition to soil during the fall. So, yeah, as we put out things like dry fertilizer, a lot of times after we're doing our soil sampling, we're going to go out and put out our MAP, DAP, potash, MEZ, those sorts of things as we get ready for next year. And those dry materials need to be mineralized by the microbial communities in the soil in order for those to be available to our plants. And so as your cool conditions in the fall and your cool conditions in the spring don't really propel that process forward. And so that can limit the efficiency of those products. So the mineralization process needs assistance to overcome the depressed microbial activity. Where does that assistance come from? Is it biochemistry? You're exactly right. So we have a dry fertilizer enhancement product called Titan. And that Titan is using that biochemistry from the soil microbial community to then leverage that biochemistry to make the nutrition more available. So we'll take that biochemistry, we'll actually sparge it onto the dry fertilizer ahead of time so that when you're putting it out, the biochemistry that we would hope to be provided by the soil microorganisms is on those fertilizer prills so that we can start that mineralization process and have it ready to go when the crop season hits next year. How effective is Titan XC in boosting fertilizer efficiency? Well, we have, you know, probably 300 trials over the last uh, 12 or 15 years. We're looking at you know, closing in on 100 million acres. And I would say in general, we're looking at probably like a 15 to 20 percent improvement in nutrient use efficiency. Excellent, Ron. Where can people go to learn more? Go to CropFertility.com and you can read a whole page there around Titan.